so it's now 8 53 p.m and i'm not gonna be um that much longer on here but i, I at first i was trying to do like one live stream and let it be like 25 minutes but um thankfully i had a lot of supporters in there and um i had at least about three perps and um i had about three perps in the live stream so it was raining harder than what it's raining now and they had this pretend homeless perp that had no bag and it was just his he had nothing but the clothes on his back and his dog with him and so he's trying to be stealthy and hide where the pretend home was female perp. Um, he, he's trying to hide where she's at. But the fact that it's a guy with a dog, it makes me feel even more unsafe. And then I, I have to pee really bad and can't use the bathroom because he's over here. Or I can't go potty because he, he's around here. But I think that, I mean, and so he tried to, and he had all other places he could have gone to get out of the rain, but he just raped the opportunity to freaking come over here with his dog near me to try to surveil and p pretend to fake monitor me and stuff like that. So I would be damned to have a pretend homeless male perp with a dog trying to intimidate and frighten me to sit here for I don't know how long tonight. I wish I had I wish I did help with an Uber and a hotel room for the night so I can be safe. And I mean dealing with this rain and stuff. This is and then people going to sit there and leave me to be in danger. And I can't call the police because I was doing a live stream and the police was hit me in the head with the directed energy weapons plus um muting and silencing my phone and now they hit me. I'm being hit. And you know what? I'm wondering if the perp with the dog is hitting me with the damn energy weapons. I mean, I've been hitting all in the damn head with the directed energy weapons. So um, I'm, I'm wondering if, if, that, if he's around the corner where the pretend homeless female was. And I do not feel comfortable or safe over here. So, um... I'm letting y'all know that it was not me playing with the mic. It was the perps using the directed energy weapons and manipulating my, and hacking my phone. So I wish I did have help with the hotel room to get off the streets. You know, so, um, I have to pee really bad and my head hurts so bad. And, um, you know, I don't feel safe out here. And, um, yeah, I'm sorry if I sound repetitive because my anxiety is high and I'm really nervous. And, um, you know, the ever since now that they want to traffic me, that they, 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 I've been, the gang stalking has ramped up. It's ramped up. So, um, I don't know. If, I don't. I, I'm. I don't feel safe to. It's gonna be another night of sleep deprivation because I don't feel safe to. To. I don't feel safe to. To sleep with him being nearby. I don't feel safe to sleep ne with him nearby. So um, I wish he would go away because he doesn't even look like he's homeless. But he was has no no bag, but wearing dirty clothes. And um, had a dog with him. So um, I wish he, I wish he would go away. I really wish he would go away. And then he got defensive, and you know, he got really defensive when I um, when I when I mentioned about him, you know, being a perp and stuff. So um. I can't be on here. My phone, through, from live streaming, my phone was all, all the way down to 71% from a 100. So now my phone is at 70%. And 
I can't use up that much of my phone data. And so I got to have a lot of battery left in case anything goes crazy. So, um, I wish I had help with the hotel room. And as I said, it was the gang stalkers and the police hit me with their directed energy weapons and muting my phone and stuff so to silence me from my dog on live stream. So I'm gonna go for now and um I wish I wish I did have help with a hotel room, but I'm gonna go and see y'all next video.